is going on Team Tweety? I hope you're all super well. It is a little bit late here, so I need to keep it down a bit. We're starting this vlog off here tonight. I'm going to take you through the day. So basically, it all started this morning when it was pouring rain. The agent that I've been speaking to, Dash Scout, has been back and forth with me, and we managed to organize a time to speak this morning. But before I get into that, I want to say, if you guys have not turned on your post notifications, what you got to do is see that little bell next to the subscribe button, click on that, and then you will be notified every time I upload on YouTube and you're gonna want to be notified over the next week maybe week and a half that's when I'm going to be recovering from my injury and when I'm back from that man oh man do I have some exciting content for you guys so you're gonna want to stay tuned and the best way to do that is turn on your post notifications just join the notification gang so anyway Team Tweety let's get into this phone call and then I have a bit of a commentary over the rehab and strength work I did this morning with the physio at Crawley Town which is like the exercises that the first team do so excited for that okay so I'm just about to go on the phone with the Asian I've been speaking about for the last couple of days. Not going to be able to film any of it because it's raining. I do like to film my phone calls just so you guys get an idea of what I say to these agents and coaches but it's raining so I'm going to put this away and then I'll give you guys an update after. Phone call is done. I've got the stadium behind me. That is the Crawley Town first team pitch. Interesting little discussion. So in about 10 days time or so, I'm going to be playing, well, hopefully playing a friendly match between some of these players that this guy is going to organize. It's going to be an 11 v 11, which is so important for me. When I go into these trials with these six division clubs, I need to make sure that I'm on top of my game. I haven't played a match in a while. I've been out injured, so I need to be ready 100%. And that includes much fitness, a little bit of much experience as well. So after that match, probably in about two weeks, I'll be going to trial with one sixth division club. And then there's two other teams that are almost backup opportunities. So let's see what happens. Over the next two weeks, I really need to be preparing myself, making sure I'm recovering from this injury and I'm ready for those trials. Because this might well be one of the most important trials along this journey. Hopefully not, because I want to go from 6th division even higher. But even then, if I'm in 6th division, I want to get immediately signed into another team. I, I think that's how it works. Correct me if I'm wrong. I'm not trying to be cocky. But I'm pretty sure when you're in 6th division, they just sign you straight away. They don't bring you in on trial. Let me know in the comments. I'm not sure. But ideally, that's a situation I'd love to happen. I've got a gym session somewhere. And I'll also get a bit of footage for you guys as well. So let's go find this place. So I just want to do a bit of a voice over this clip. I've got it on my computer here while I'm talking with you guys. I'm up in the top left corner. This is really weird because I can see the screen and I'm not there. But I know in this video, I'm going to be there. So this is basically the workout routine that I'm doing here. Uh, it's a five minute bike warm up. And well, let me just start off by saying that this uh, fitness exercise was put together for me by the physio of the under 23s. She's also worked or been like the assistant physio or helped out with the first team before the under 23s was created. She's very, very good. But this workout goes five minute warm up two minutes of 30 seconds on 30 seconds off so when it's on you're sprinting on that bike and off is just resting then it goes into straight away you go into two minutes of 20 minutes on 10 seconds off for two minutes and then straight away again you go into two minutes 10 seconds hard five seconds off and then that should be about six minutes and then you do three minutes of just uh constant so just simple cycling uh, nothing intense, just relaxing the body. Then you get two minutes off, and I repeated that three times, and she was telling me that usually it's four minutes, so instead of the two, you do four, but because I'm just coming back from injury, she just brought it down a little bit for me. But man, this was intense. I've done stuff like this before. It's very football related. You can see my face. It is a killer, and my progression now is to do the bike. So I've done the bike, uh, and then I think I do the bike again on Friday. And from there, I then go into the cross trainer and then go into the treadmill. So that's basically my bike workout. Very, very tough. Try it. Let me know how you fit. Oh, let me know what you think of it. And now this is the gym work. I did two sets of this tough stuff. I was pushing myself very hard. And I'm only going to be in this video for like the first bit. The rest of this, uh, the physio, she is very good. She was taking me through the different steps. So you can hear her fixing up my form. And these are exercises that you can do as well. If you want me to maybe do this again and then give the reps and everything, let me know in the comments. <sighs> tough workout, very tough day. Five, four, three, two, one, relax. And then go here. Turn up. That we can see too. Place this way. So, you do bicep curl. Yeah. Twist it. Push up. Okay. Up. Good. Twist it. 
So you're controlling that. Good. Up. Twist it and push. Good. Slowly control down. Keep that going. Of 10. Good. Five, four, three, two, one. Relax. Good. Good. And try and keep your back more upright. Another five. I just want your feet together. Like that? Yeah. Good. I'll keep it going. Last ten. Three. Get another one. Two. One. And relax. Good. Now to finish this vlog off, I want to say that I've always spoken about vitamins and how important they are and usually I slack off on them. I don't take them enough but I found out a pretty good routine that you guys can get into to make sure that you're taking them every single day. So basically I got them all stacked up here and this is at my desk. This is where I am every single day whether it's editing, watching a bit of YouTube, whatever I'm doing, I'm here. And then on top of that, I got my water, so I can literally just sit here, get my fish oil out, take that, and then take all of the other necessary tablets. So what I recommend you do, if you have a bedside table, or if you have a desk that you're always sitting at, the place that you're at the most, 
Put your tablets there, line them up, set a time and take them then because you don't want to miss out on the routine. They're very important for your body. For all you OG supporters, I did a whole video on that with Ed, so you can check that one out. I think it's like day 11 or 10. So yeah, I'm getting back in the routine. But anyway, guys, Team 2 I'm signing out. Make sure you leave a like on this video. Subscribe if you're new around. Teach you on the journey. I'll see you in tomorrow's video. Bye. Bye.